Love. Love, you got me down the drain again. Out from fantasies, realities, impossibilities. Numbing my heart with unfulfilled desires. Voids that can never be filled with a tangible lust. Or faces of night that can never understand the human in me. Much as I want to leave this behind, cheeks still burn like an oven when I see her face in the crowd for years to pass beyond my youth. You're still the one that got away. All I remember from these hallways. Raspberry smile, blood crescent moon, amber eyes, ginger syrup to heal wounds. Of a battered heart and aching soul, trapped in a prison. And a soothing voice puts me through a great slumber for nights when I can't dream no more. Always quiet as can be. All's heard are the boots that skip across the glistening gymnasium floors. Excuse the dust that I've carried for miles on end to the tundra of unearthed emotions. Relics fossilized beyond recognition, only to be revived every once in a millennium. Please do forgive me if I may ask you this question. Can you bring back the life in me? For so long, I brought my heart out to seek the love I deserved my peers on screens and books and hallways. High school sweethearts, they may call us. Oh, to carry you in my arms, pick you up like a father holds his child, hearing you laugh with excitement like we're riding a roller coaster of such passion and aggressive fervor, taking souls by the beach near shores that once ran red like the setting sun. Oh, the look in those amber eyes, wishing I could be yours forever. We can run far, never to return, live in a cottage of our own, or a beach house by the pier, so we can have the best catch on Sunday. Whatever you wish is my command. Alas, not all dreams can last forever. Not even ones close to this reality. For once, a chance at love may never break my heart. Oh, to face the humility once more. The embarrassment of falling for another. Who wouldn't return my hand for reasons beyond my control. Then, that one afternoon, you invited me for a session at the library. Just one hour, you and I, big round table. Our sleeves mingling with each other's fabrics, I hope I was made for you. I hope that watching you stare at my pen, scribbling out symbols and letters, excited you as much as excited me. I hope you wake one morning, thinking about the ink that bled onto the paper, how it shined like the sapphires around your wrist. I hope that you're happy, wherever you are, whoever you're with. Nights have spent writing about you, and a million dreams I could have spent with you. Days have gone watching as you seek the happiness I could have had with you. Should have known that it all came down for this charade to end. That I could never be with you. The night that exploded in colors, standing on the rocks near the river, I watched my love go for the last time. Like a Polaroid drifting along the summer winds, off into the rippling light of her lunar smile, grinning as she watches the tear fall like rain on a desert island of my dreams. Starved of the reality, left for a dreaded eternity. One more step to the heart, yet I couldn't part. Guess it was all a joke. Wish I had spent those nights on stories that were worth my time, instead of wasting it on someone like you. Bet the audience had a laugh when they heard about your study buddy. Did they also hear about how I looked at you every morning, five minutes before the bell, watching you clutch your books and smile at your friends? Or when I left you that quarter to get that last back of tackies, how does one enjoy those things? All the things I overlooked in consideration of your hand, if you ever dared to offer. Now that I look back on it, you couldn't bear to be seen with someone like me. Can't risk being outed for something so innocent. Too afraid to break the mold set on suppressing our true nature. No use in changing what can't be fixed, for the ending establishes our paths. In the midst of the deceiving spell, sea breeze awakens my smile. I stir up a seagull was flying over the ocean, so blue in his eyes. How his eyes stared at her when she held him so, and I stood on the rocks, tears down into the water, dissolving my emotional betrayal. My oh my, how the summer winds remind me of mornings that I awake with a million songs to write, for birds a chant of her departure from my heart, a relic freed of his ice-bound prison. Oh, summer sun, smile so wide, let her read what I wrote, about the one I nearly caught but thrown off by a beast that crawls like a monstrous crustacean 
along the floor and snatches his maiden, fallen for the siren of my dreams. Discarded notes, detailed dreams, shared with no one but my files were locked away, where the key fashioned so meticulously to one's own frail touch. As I read, memories of our time, partners as peers, yet barred by standards, may I laugh at this song, speaking of how much I wanted you? It stands are written by a fool. May these words rest in eternal peace. Feel your cespia skin, your burnt caramel hair on my skin, a tint of mockery beach sands, your hazel eyes, the love of my frigid soul. Bestow with the power to turn my cold stone heart into a fountain of joy. I could let you run into my arms, but I see you watch him. Go to your eternal happiness while I put my love in an eternal sleep, an eternal sleep. Can I put you in an eternal sleep?